Hey guys, welcome back to Ivy Crypto. Hope you're all having a fantastic day. Now, in a couple of my previous videos, I've talked about the Web 3.0, and you've probably heard tons of things about this by now, but do you really know what it means and how deep it can go? I wanted to make a short video talking about the Web 3.0 and what it is. Now, there's some articles here from CoinMarketCap, there's a Medium article by Fabric Ventures and a Forbes article of what Web 3.0 actually is and what does it really mean. So from my understanding, the Web 3.0 aims to be the next generation of the internet based to an open network of interconnected decentralized applications. It is censorship resistant and there is no silos or boundaries like the internet has right now. The Web 3.0 additionally has the potential to bring value to entirely new asset classes by offering platform agnostic ownership of digital items with verifiable authenticity that everyone can agree on. Before the blockchain, this had not even been possible. Our innate values of different forms of ownership, connections, and scarcity can't be tampered with in the Web 3.0 economy. That is because value is baked in to the previously intangible assets themselves at the technical level on the blockchain. Let's compare to fully understand the implications of this. For example, option A, set up medium, try to make a website and get paid through Google AdSense. Pros, easy. Cons, Medium takes 50% cut, Google takes 32% cut, services are centralized across one platform, lack of ownership, and limited. Option B, create NFT, which gives access to special pages to, on my blog. Grant users roles in a secret discord while getting them in a room in the metaverse. Plus, automatically distribute a percentage of NFT sales back to the holders. I think we all know which one we would choose. I hope this clears up some of the confusion regarding what Web3 actually is. I think of it like a series of open decentralized building blocks for people to create entirely new types of dApps on Ethereum. I hope you guys understood and enjoyed this video. And if you have any more questions about the Web3, please feel free to ask me. But I think it's really important to understand what is happening and this could be truly revolutionary for us as young people, for the internet and for generations to come. This means true ownership for us. It cuts out the middleman. And just remember that when we are toying with this idea, when we are creating the things that we need to get to this Web3 economy, this Web3 world, there will be people that don't want this to happen there will be fud because it cuts out so many middlemen i mean we're talking banks we're talking uh, websites we're talking big corporates we're talking millions and billions of dollars that will be given back to the people and remember there will always be fud and there will always be naysayers and there will always be people talking about the cons because the pros are not good for them they are not good for these corporates they don't want the people to have power so please be aware of what is going on be vigilant take part in this because it is going to be revolutionary and i can't wait to join you guys on the ride don't forget to like this video guys subscribe to the channel for plenty more general crypto content plenty more videos to learn about the web 3.0 about nfts and about what is coming as well as some crypto projects that i think are up and coming and always don't forget to watch this space